Now I've got an extremely rare fish here, which is a beautiful little black tang. You just see him there behind the coral. He's, he's always out the front, but he decides to hide, of course, when I get the video camera out, which is pretty normal, don't work with fish and children. Um, hardy little fish, um, but very expensive. Now, what, as you can see, this oh, stupid little damsel is attacking him. Oh, your yeah, damsel's doing what a damsel does. And that damsel was put in this tank when he was a very tiny, golden, black, little striped, beautiful fish, not by put in there by myself I'll add and now he's getting older and getting a bit sort of more mature and now he's bashing up my black tang and when a three dollar fish when a three dollar cost fish is bashing up a almost fifteen hundred dollar cost fish it's not too much fun so after many failed attempts to remove the damsel yesterday oh here we go it's got some on-screen action going on here so that stupid little $3 damsel, which is bashing up my $1,500 fish, and I'm not talking retail either, I'm talking cost. So I'm going to have the joyous job of pulling this whole tank down in order to catch a $3 damsel. And I'm considering eating it myself. That's how impressed with this job I am. The joys of fish keeping, unfortunately, you get situations like this. It's a $3 fish bashing a $1,500 fish. I would have worked out the maths to figure out how much more that is in value, but I, I can't even figure that out. 500 times. This fish is worth 500 times that fish, but it's getting bashed. A beautiful little gold flake angel. So I do have another reason for pulling this tank down because I do have to get the gold flake out anyway. So I'm glad I caught this on video because every time I showed Luke that the um, the damsel was bashing it, he wasn't wouldn't do anything. But now I can see. Told you, Luke. I told you he was bashing it. <laughs> 